hey guys welcome back to another video on try hack me capture the flag challenge today we will be working on one of the beginner level ctf challenge and its name is pokemon or gotta catch them all so let's get started the uh, machine is uh, already running so let's copy the ip address and see the uh, question so we need to find the grass type pokemon water type fire day fire type and roots favorite pokemon and that's it i just completed this lab right now so i will be uh, walking through again um so sudo nmap um sc4 common script sv4 version and the ip address and the password so nmap is started now meanwhile this is running let's uh, check the web version that is always good to check if something is hosted on web so one thing which is not uh, usual is the title can you find them all so um, on the page we don't see anything uh, interesting here so maybe let's check the source so control u for the source and um, you can uh, quickly scroll through the things and check the comments so these are default comments and then in the last it says check console for extra surprise and there is something um, in HTML tag so initially what I thought uh, that the that uh, the console is this console um, which is JavaScript console basically so here we can see um, the array of, of different Pokemon and we can find um, this array here so you can uh, try uh, working around with, with this if we can find anything but uh, I, I could not find anything interesting maybe this is just just a distraction for us and then the other thing which is mentioned in the hint of the first question is colors are beautiful so the second thing which uh, this could be is because of this semicolon is the uh, style sheet so maybe some kind of color so pokemon colon something I try to um, work on this but again this is not uh, it is so basically this is the SSH credential straight away so we don't need anything else so this is the user this is the password uh, I have just masked few characters of it um, and let's go back to our nmap scan so it just say port 80 and 22 so let's go straight to the um, uh, SSH and the IP address is 10.10.204.168 and the password is hack underscore something and we should be in yep ls so we couple of things we see couple of things example dot desktop and some other folder so first thing first let's see example dot desktop is not set to executable and maybe let's read uh, the example dot desktop so this is kind of uh, some default entry i'm not familiar with this so nothing interesting here so quitting and then let's find everything um, in current directory so we'll be able to see uh, everything which is stored in the in our home directory including desktop downloads videos and everything so this is just dot local slash and then music public nothing interesting here then scrolling up um, Mozilla Firefox this is all cache entries uh, so 
after cache we can we are moved to config okay so and then we can see couple of things here so first of all uh, under videos go to catch them all could this be what I am looking for C++ and then uh, the desktop Pokemon so videos and desktop two things uh, which we have found and then this is a Mozilla Firefox entries that's it so <clears throat> let's check the desktop thing first ls pokemon dot zip so maybe unzip um, pokemon dot zip file okay so this is grass type uh, dot text so the next question uh, was grass type only so we got our answer here most likely so let's check the content uh, CD space uh, Pokemon and then cat grass type so this is some kind of um, um, encoding again I have masked some characters and basically the encoding looks like in some hex format so maybe we can check something like um, convert from hex so uh, hexadecimal to decimal hexadecimal to text most likely this should be fine uh, so text to hex numbers hex number to text and uh, it just ignored these masked bits and translated uh, remaining bits to text so this is another uh, answer which is grass type Pokemon so the next is water type Pokemon and then fire type so in the water type Pokemon you can see the hint is maybe the website has an answer so um, we can check on the website side because because we are in the box and we can come to videos folder later so I uh, uh, check the video folder first and I got the answer uh, for this one and this one but for now I am just uh, following this sequence to walk you through so let's uh, check in the um, website directory what slash ww slash html and we can see water type dot text so uh, let's check the content word ww html and water type so this is another um, flag which is the answer of water type pokemon but again uh, by looking at the characters which is not masked you can see that these are not something meaningful so again there is a encoding used here which is um, Caesar cipher so or you can check uh, road 13 cipher so it is not exactly road 13 but um, it is Caesar cipher and we need to change uh, this to 14 I guess yes so this is this is the uh, decoded version so wrote 14 basically we need to use to decode the answer and now uh, moving forward find the fire type Pokemon and then the root so for these two flags let's uh, check the videos part uh, dot dot slash dot dot slash videos and um, go to check them all ls so this is a kind of uh, C++ file 
I try to compile this uh, with GCC. GCC is installed on this um, machine. So you can ignore this part. This is not the part of the CTF. So we can check the content of this uh, file. So what is written in this? So um, the content is quite simple, a main function and returns nothing and this is again uh, a username and passwords for one user so we can check the home directory there is a user called ASH and there is a roots pokemon.txt as well so we um, ls minus l slash home so we cannot uh, read this as of now we need to jump to user ASH with this password so I'm uh, taking the SSH directly or maybe let's uh, open another window and take the uh, console from here for user ASH and the password is 10.10.204.168 and then the password and we are in so ID you can check uh, sudo and what we can run using sudo we can run everything so basically we are root in this machine so let's check the content of roots or uh, not roots slash home slash root slash pokemon dot text not ls basically uh, I wanted to check the content copy paste and uh, this is uh, another flag for uh, roots pokemon so this is the answer of this roots favorite pokemon but one is still left which is fire type pokemon so just did a blind uh, search with the find command so find fire uh, let's increase the size um find dot and then type f and maybe just uh, type name and fire so lots of files are coming um we can do we can uh, pipe this to the null or maybe let's be more specific because i already know the file name uh, locate file and hyphen so not file hyphen but fire hyphen so uh, this thing fire hyphen type so you will straight away get the uh, exact file and you can uh, basically check the content of this file again so cat um, then the path and this is another uh, encoded message in base 64 so there is no further encoding you can write directly uh, decode this and you will be able to uh, see the flag so that's it i hope you have uh, enjoyed this um, uh, challenge and learn something new this is quite easy and straightforward uh, the only thing which is not relevant is this array um, and uh, this uh, script uh, thing which is mentioned here in the JavaScript so this is the only part which is not uh, relevant um, to complete this lab and rest everything was quite straightforward I hope you have enjoyed uh, if so please keep watching videos if you have any suggestion please mention in comments like subscribe have a great day bye bye